Tonight, WTAJ is investigating a guilty plea that's loosely connected to the Timothy Piazza case and hazing. Our Evan Hinckley was inside the courthouse today for the plea. He joined us now live with more on the brothers' charges. Evan. John and Amanda, today Joseph M's 22 years old, pled guilty to hazing and uh, criminal counts related to liquor. But he's not guilty of hazing Piazza. Rather, another pledge here at the Beta Theta Pi house. Uh, basically, the hazing that occurred on the same night as Piazza's death. Wednesday was a relatively short day in court for Joseph Ems. He gave a few yeses, affirming his guilty plea to the judge, and allowed his new attorney, John Abom, to do most of the talking. The topping in question was what happened the night of February 2, 2017. Ems was originally facing reckless endangerment charges, accused of throwing a shoe at Timothy Piazza's body and slapping him in the abdomen after he had fallen down a flight of steps due to heavy intoxication. However, in this guilty plea, there's no mention of any crimes related to pledge Timothy Piazza. Ems' current charges stem from his interaction with another pledge, Thaddeus Lorenz, to whom Ems gave a bottle of vodka and tilted the bottle up while Lorenz was drinking it. The defense strategy to plead guilty now is a smart one, according to our legal analyst, especially given Ems' charges compared to those of his fellow brother, recently sentenced Ryan Burke. As a defense attorney, uh, you can look at your client and say, well, your case isn't as um, difficult or as serious as what the first person's was. Um, the longer you wait, the more the judge is going to say you're not accepting responsibility for your actions. So let's, let's get to court quickly. And tonight at 6, I'll have more on what we can expect for M's sentencing. Reporting live in State College, Evan Hinckley, WTAJ News.